Okay, you all here? Alright, I'm trying out a new effect in place of my, uh, yeah, in place of, and this is the beater guitar, and I've had, I've been working on something, you can't see anything, can you? Son of a bitch! This is more of a test anyways, I don't care if you can actually see my head. This is a hearing thing. It's not playing, it's not about speed, it's not about anything. It's about what do you hear? So, you should start with it nothing and go from there okay so I got a little overdrive going that's it <laughs> Okay, so, this is called TC Electronic, it's from TC Electronic, it's called Mimic. It's supposed to mimic you playing one, two, or three guitars. And there you say the, you know, best way to get that effect is two amps. And I always run two amps, and I run it through my, you know, MXR, uh, Zach Wild, uh, chorus, stereo chorus. Because it gives it texture, and it gives a separation, and I like it. And it sounds like that Die of a Madman sound, which I like. But it's my tweet diary. It's like I am tweak when I'm sitting on my glasses. Damn it! How many glasses do I got to sit on and break? I'm not going to even try. Okay, so this is it. That's, okay, so you just heard it. That's my two amps, Marshall and the PV. That's it. No effects. Alright, so let's turn this little bastard on. Now it's going to mimic one. So I guess it's just... put it on too so there's dry there's three controls and it's effect um jeez god it's great to be blind effect so there's three settings for one you know you're duplicating one extra one two extra which we're on two right now or one no two because one was just me, two is two guitars, and three would be three guitars or instruments. So it's got the effect, the dry, that's all it says, and <laughs> for ass sakes, what does that say? Tightness. Okay, so effect, tightness, and dry. And the other beautiful thing about this from TC Electronic. No instructions. So, I watched the video. I get the gist of it. I know what tightness and dry and all that crap is. You turn effect down, you get nothing. You turn tightness and, you know, closes it up so it doesn't sound... Like right now, everything is wide open. It's cranked. Effect, dry is not dry. It's very undry. And, uh, you know... You know, the wet and dry signal. Everybody knows about that, right? Okay, don't have to explain it. And then tightness. So right now I want it wide. I want it big. So there's my big with on the first. <laughs> Oh, my God. 
let's go to the last, which would be three. So now you're supposed to think that you're hearing three different guitars. And I guess they do that, they say, by, you know, separating the signal in milliseconds from, you know, between amps. Beep, 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 beep. This was done when I went in and did my first demo to get that Mick Mars sound, because when he went in, he went in and did one track. They did the, you know, millisecond delay to throw on the stereo to get the sound bigger. And I did that on my first demo, it sounded great. This doesn't quite get it, it just sounds like an echo or a reverb to me. But I can hear it big, I can hear it big, so we're trying to see if you can hear this as big on the stereo mic. Okay. <laughs> I tried three and tightened it, still didn't sound right to me. So two seems to be good. It's good. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
stuck in that too but if I see that's because I played too many Randy Rhodes type guitars this I got a lot of them here most of them I don't have the Jackson V and uh, like three of the V's I don't have here um that's why I always play and they're like oh you're a big Randy guy and, well yeah I took a couple of, I took some lessons from them I don't you know I couldn't tell you how many exactly I took a few months before, because see, I can tell the story. I'm not going to get into it, but see, it wasn't. It didn't ever occur to me because he was just here. He was like a guy, and it didn't occur to me until my friend Brent played for me, and I'm like, holy crap, this guy's light years ahead of me. It can't be because he's that better. He's got a better teacher because my guy was teaching me how to play, you know, jazz chords that I don't. <laughs> I barely remember today and I don't ever use but uh he's a nice guy Joe Larry Larson so in 79 I flipped over to Musonia took some lessons he split Randy and then I didn't like George Lynch so I didn't bother and then I heard uh, they had a new guy Craig and I went back and I stayed with Craig for like a you know 11th grade 12th grade last part 11th 12th and uh, after I graduated, I got my girlfriend pregnant and all. And I met her at Musonia, which is all weird. So it's all intertwined and, you know, oh, you know how sweet a romance bloomed at Musonia. This is Randy's mom. She thought it was very nice. And we ended up getting married, had a baby. Thought She thought we were going to name him Randy, but I named him Vincent after uh, Alice Cooper. <laughs> And that was going to be my stage name, Vincent Michael. But I gave him Vincent Michael, excuse, and I'm Michael D. Because my middle name is Douglas. It's just Michael D, E, E. It's like the like glam thing. So all I did there is I put in a phaser on low. <laughs> So you can hear it a little bit, just to give it some something. So, to me, I'm already getting what I want in the stereo chorus, and I don't know if adding this after the chorus would be smart. Probably not, but it does have a stereo in. So I could come out of the chorus, stereo, and then into that. I might try it later at some point, but right now, 
to me it's just doing something that I've already got something else doing that does it better so for 129 bucks you know I'll show it to you guys so you know I usually go, but I don't care it's freaking Saturday night it's hot I don't want to dick with things but so that's it let me flip my screen around so I know what you're seeing that's it you see everything's uh, cranked that's what I usually use the uh, that and that gives me my sound the little chorus the stereo separation and even some tone tonal stuff this is giving me whatever and it doesn't even click when you turn it off it's just it's you know because you want that click to know it's on there's nothing there it just it just goes off there's no click like that bugs me too <laughs> so like this boom you know it's off that you don't know but you see the light but on stage i don't have to worry about stage right now so there you go that's my test of the you know i'm gonna put it up as the testing of that all right have a good saturday night and happy father's day to all you fathers out there and all you mothers keep being a mother See ya. How do you operate this gadget? Hmm.